book. Hey, what's your crazy daddy doing? Hey, what, what are you doing? In his face. 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 Fuck John Cannon. Till March. I'm just giving myself a six inch range to sneak you. It's, it's gonna be that quick. You, you, th you th like we're gonna be doing a collab. You're gonna be chilling, and you're gonna be like, oh yeah, I'm doing these curls, and it's gonna be just like that, just like that. That. Whoop. I want y'all to look at this black motherfucker right here, boy. I thought I talk shit. I thought I talk shit. I'm gonna get your ass. I'm gonna get you. You good, babe? You calm down? I heard you wanted to be big. I heard you wanted to be what? Massive. Cut. Lean. Six inches, motherfucker. That's all I need. Hey, right, look, bro. We about to head to the gym. We about to That's hit. All you need, babe. What? Six inches. I mean, it fills you up. <laughs> Ballin' bitch! <laughs> hey, look, man, we about to go to the gym and hit some arms. But while I'm hitting arms, I'm gonna be telling you about. Come here, buddy. Come here. I'm gonna be telling you about my cutting routine that I'm doing right now. A lot of people have been asking me what have I been doing for my cut. So just tag along, and we're gonna let you know what I'm doing for my cut. All right. So what we're gonna do? We're just gonna head to the gym. And uh, we'll catch you there, alright? DJ Bango, baby. Alright, so one thing that I started doing, really simple, really simple, started hitting cardio. Every day I'm banging out like 20 to 30 minutes of cardio, whether if it's jumping rope, walking on a treadmill, doing an elliptical, something, bro. But the thing is, like on my leg days, I may just walk on a treadmill, you know what I mean? Like today, we did arms. Before I actually got here, when I got off work, I was on the stair stepper for about 30 minutes, and you know that's like extreme cardio. So basically, what I started doing was, like I said, just before every workout, Gotta break my shit, Chris. Fuck, nigga. I'm gonna but, uh, break your water bottle. Make a shit happen. But uh, like I said, I just started incorporating cardio, man, and like just every day. Nothing like I wouldn't even say nothing past 30 minutes, man. But just because I'm trying to get right for this expo, I'm not gonna be at my leanest. And the thing is, I'm not counting macros right now either. So I'm gonna finish up this set, and we're gonna catch you a little bit later. All right? So check this out, right? Y'all motherfuckers think I'm big. I, I, I'm, I'm gonna let him give his height and weight. I seen this motherfucker pull up like what, 650 pounds on deadlift, no problem. No way. Look, look at this big motherfucker. Look at his arms. What is? What is that? I don't know why what he calls that? me out. I'm small. What is that? Look at that big shit right there, boy. Hey, Bull Sweet Fitness family right here, bro. Interested, introduce yourself to the people. I'm Wood. Uh, see this guy grinding in here all the time. Always in here representing. Hey, bro. Cool, sweet. Appreciate you, big dog. Yeah, one, one day I'm gonna get big, just like him. One day. I'm trying to catch him. <laughs> <laughs> but look, we about to go to single arm bicep curls. Another tip. Well, something that I do. The first month, and I know a lot of you motherfuckers are not gonna agree with it. I don't give a shit. This is me. I've done bulked and cut for about three years, and I know exactly what works for me. The first month that I cut weight, I do not count macros. Why? I get burnt out real quick. And I know a lot of you motherfuckers will be like, but sweet, that's the grind, bro, that's the grind. Look, man, I know what works for me, all right? The thing is, I eat clean. I eat clean and I cut a lot of my meals out. But the thing is, I'm not counting macros as of right now. Like February 1st, I will be counting macros. But like I said, as of right now, I'm just eating clean, you know, eating me about a solid four to five meals a day. And I'm still dropping weight, you know what I mean? Because I went from eating a lot of carbs to cutting the carbs out. So that's another tip. If you're just starting out cutting, 
Maybe leave the macros alone for a month, the first month, all right? You recording? Yeah, we're good. We're in there. Hey, look, man, another tip that I started doing, bro. You have to drink a shit ton of water. You have to drink a bunch of water, man. Like, I'm pushing close to a gallon and a half a day now. It is, yes, it is a burden. You're gonna be peeing every five minutes. If you have a desk job, me, I work at a gym. So I can happily and freely walk to the bathroom anytime I need to. But when you're drinking all this extra water, you're flushing all the water that you already have in your system out. So you may drop, you know, I know a lot of people look at the scale for, you know, motivation and everything. You may drop, if you start drinking a gallon of water a day, you may drop two pounds, you know, in two weeks because you're flushing all this excessive water that's already in your system out due to, more than likely, high sodium intake from all this fast food that you're eating shit. But look, man, just increase your water. That's another tip that I've been doing to help me drop this weight. Get off your phone and work it out. What? What? I'm handling business, nigga. Let's talk to the hoes. But, um. What? Nothing. I love you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let me stop fucking before you punch me in the face. I know you're real. Hey, look, something else that I started doing supersets. I do a bunch of supersets now. What does a superset consist of? If you're new to the fitness game, a superset is let's say, I'm gonna do an example for you. Let's say I grab these 30 pound dumbbells, right? And I curl them 10 times each arm. As soon as I'm done, instead of taking a break, I run straight to another machine and I go ahead and start doing the exercise. That is a superset, okay? So what I'm gonna do, because what it does, it keeps your heart rate up. So you're gonna burn extra calories and it also allows for an awesome pump, bro. see John do this in a video bro I'm calling you out John I, I just want to see and you can sit here and be like I ain't gotta prove nobody wrong stop being a bitch nigga you really got something against John <laughs> it's my nigga bro we just stay talking shit to each other it's like, it's like a little brother big brother thing you know what I mean fuck that shit nigga I'm back to sweet man fuck you nigga let's see how many of these you can do I'm calling you out, bro. Three. Three. And I'm tired. 
three and I'm tired. I wanna see how many you can get. And they were clean, right? They were clean, I made sure they were clean. Fuck you, John. Now blow him a kiss. Blow him a kiss. I'm sorry, John. <laughs> Kristen says that I have to love you. <laughs> So one more tip real quick while I'm up. Had to make it a little bit heavier. They said Sean Ollie was out there with fucking 20 inch arms and shit. I gotta get ready for this collab. You better eat your damn ghost pepper, bro. Like why hasn't he eaten this ghost pepper yet, Chris? Nobody knows, right? We need to eat that ghost pepper, we don't. But look, another tip, my final tip. You guys, this is just what I'm doing. This is just what I'm doing. Fuck you guys that are like, I do this, I do that. I'm just telling the people what works for me. Don't hate on me, all right? But look, being disciplined, bro. Being disciplined is like the number one thing. I can't tell you how many times I go out to restaurants. Of course I want burger and fries, bro. But instead, like lately, I'm doing like chicken breasts and like rice and shit. You know what I mean? So you just gotta be disciplined. If you know your friends are going to Krispy Kreme, be like, you know what, I'll meet you guys after Krispy Kreme, because I know damn well if I go into Krispy Kreme, I'm gonna eat me a donut, you know what I mean? But you gotta be disciplined enough to make sure like, hey, maybe I shouldn't go there because they're gonna be doing some slick shit and I don't need to be eating these sweets. So, just be disciplined. Hey, look, man, we're gonna go ahead and end this video for you guys. These are just the tips that I do. Again, fuck John Kenny, but um, <laughs> don't forget as always, tell your moms, tell your aunts, Tell your baby sisters, long as she over what? 18? I was looking at you. I was seeing how beautiful you were, so. Don't fucking look. I'm being genuine right now. You see how I get treated, bro? I'm like being genuine like to this girl. She's looking at me like. Cause me it, that seems sarcastic. Like it had a secret meaning behind it. Long as she over 18. Say it again. Say long as she over 18. I've already did that. I just gotta say over 18. Bunch of 18. You tell them about us. This is what I have to deal with.